Today we're taking a look at the Zool Quantum Axis um, Fanless Windows um, PC. Now this is a Windows computer pushed into a little stick for your TV or whatever display that has an HDMI port. You may be saying, why is a cord cutter would I want a TV um, connected to a computer uh, with Windows? And the reason being is there's still a lot of great content only legally available through a web browser. Uh, for instance, presidential debates lately have often been streamed um, through a web browser, but finding a legal stream for Roku, Fire TV, etc. can be difficult where when you're on your web browser, there's the stream from the news site. Um, now with a device like the Quam Access, you have a full copy of Windows. Last year for the Super Bowl was legally streamed on, a, on NBC's website, I believe it was, but finding a Roku, Fire TV, etc. Um, channel app was difficult and they were shutting down the unofficial ones as quick as they could. So it is still important to have a Windows TV, even as a um, computer or cord cutter fan, whatever you are, but, um, and a stick like this is a great way to do that. So you can get access to those kind of, of uh, event shows and really just have a full copy of Windows is still great. You know, if you have a lot of content on a computer, whatever, um, as a core cutter, you know, Roku and all that's great 99% of the time. But there's still a lot of times where they just don't have the content that a browser will. So we're going to pop this open. We'll take a look at what comes with it. And then we'll come back and test it out and give you a full review. But first, let's kind of just um, check this out. So this is the actual device itself. As you can see, it's a fairly little hefty stick here. Um, there, that's my hand right there. Um, Ethernet jack, this is what makes this version definitely stand over the other one. Full USB, PC lock port there, micro USB, reset button on the side, full antenna right there for um, better, easier reception. Uh, you got the manual. Now, Azul is a US-based company right here in the United States in Florida. Kind of a nice little touch here to uh, be able to get great US customer service. They do have a telephone number. I've called that before. They got an email and live chat for customer service. So as opposed to buying a lot of these generic brands where you never know where if or where you will get customer service with Azul, um, you know exactly they're in the United States and they're a US based company. So that's one of the reasons I have recommended them in the past. So that's okay, here we go. Here is the power plug. Now it is a full copy of Windows. Um, not sure if it will run off a USB port on your TV, but I haven't tried that in the past. Would probably recommend plugging this into the wall. Micro USB charger, pretty standard plug. Now I like how the plug goes this way. Um, I like it when I'm on a power strip, I can plug a lot of these in. So let's come back here and test this out. But overall, I'm impressed. The quality feels good, good plastic, well made. So let me go test this out, come back with a hands-on review. So I've been playing around with the stick for a while now, I've been very impressed. Very fast, very stable, easy to use. Full Windows 10 comes pre-installed with it. You know, just check for updates on Windows, as you can expect, they're all there. Very happy with it. Um, let's kind of just launch um, Netflix here, give you an idea what the streaming is like with it. Uh, I've been very happy, of course, you know, volume control, all that through the TV, through the different players. It's all right here. Um, I'm using the Re um, i8 Plus uh, keyboard here. You can, um, you need a keyboard, mouse, some kind. There is a USB stick. I'm using this all in one to make it happen. So as you can see, it's very easy, fast, quick, smooth, and so forth to use. I've been very happy with it. Um, it it's a Windows PC connected to your TV in a stick at an affordable price, powerful. Um, you know, it makes a great low TV. If you want a, let's say you're in a lobby and you want a PowerPoint scroll on TV in there, this is a great option for that all in one, all right there. So overall, it's a Windows PC. If you use a Windows PC, it works great. Streaming video works great. Browsing the web works great. It's got some memory in there to install some basic programs. Um, wouldn't recommend this for gaming because there's not that much memory on it. But as a simple um, interface here, you know, for TV to run Windows, excellent, easy to use, powerful little device. Highly recommend it. Um, and again, always a good option for core cars to have a Windows PC laying around connected to your TV because there's still a lot of content that's only streamed.